Hello and Namaste everyone. Welcome to Go with Flutter. Again, I am back with new tip which is all about web view in Flutter and URL launcher in Flutter. In this tip, I had combined the tip number 9 and tip number 10 which is all about uh, uh, opening any particular link in our application or in the third party application. So URL launcher and web view works in a similar way. Uh, there is just a slight difference between them. Uh, for that reason, I had combined these both tips in a single video. Let us first start with web view. In the web view, I had added three links on uh, each of this button. When I click on medium, it will open the medium link which I had uh, which I had embedded here as a web view by a string in my application. On the similar in the similar manner, when I click on GitHub, it will open the GitHub URL which I had embedded here by a string in our application. But but when we use URL launcher in Flutter, it will open the particular link in this Flutter application and in the uh, third party application as well. Let me give you a demo. When I click on LinkedIn, it will open LinkedIn by a string in our application. When I click on this call button, it will open the phone call in our in my mobile application, which is a third party app. So I'll, I will have to go back again in my application. And if, if I click on this mail icon, it will open Gmail. And on the similar manner, when I click on this message box, it will open a messaging application in my mobile. This is how URL launcher and web view works. Hey guys. If you want to learn Flutter and thinking to dive into MNCs, then do check out a book which is available in Amazon, Flipkart and Notion Press Store named Make Yourself the Software Developer. Let's dive into Flutter and MNCs. This book is written by me, Lakshati Vikram Sa, and I had talked about my Flutter journey, all my Flutter experiences and how you can apply for the MNCs. This book will cover these following topics and I'm sure uh, in one way or the other uh, these following topics will, will help you definitely. Do check it out on Amazon, Flipkart and Notion Press Store and is available as ebook and as paperback. So don't forget to buy. Let us go to the implementation part of WebView. For WebView, you will need to import the package webview flutter once you import uh, this package you will have to just uh, you will have to just use webview widget which is uh, which is given by a webview flutter package and thereafter in the controller part you can use the uh, load request function for loading any url so here i had made custom widget where i wrap the webview widget in the scaffold and I used webview controller dot dot load, load request method for using the for showing webview in my application uh, of the particular links. So where I had uh, and I had used this widget uh, with a widget in the webview dot dot. So here I had I had a column uh, where I I had uh, imported uh, where I had imported my custom widget underscore width. I had. Uh, added a function for uh, on pressed function and thereafter icon and the label for this uh, medium linkedin and github and i had given all the links for each of this widget on clicking any of the widget this get dot two function will be called and it will navigate to weird screen where uh, where uh, the uh, this particular url will be loaded as a web view like this way on clicking medium it will open medium.com in my application as a web view so this is about web view in the url launcher you first of all you will have to import url launcher package then you will have to add some configuration in the manifest android manifest.xml file for opening the uh, third party application like call mobile uh, call message uh, email and other application you will have to define one tag which is uh, which is query this you will have to import this uh, particular configuration for messaging you will have to import uh, this line of phone application you will have to import uh, this particular uh, configuration for the uh, web view in uh, our application or in the third party application you will have to import this one and for email you will have to import this particular configuration once after setting all this configuration 
uh, we uh, we are all ready to uh, use uh, URL launcher package. So in URL launcher uh, package, I had uh, I had uh, I had called the particular function for opening the mobile app uh, mobile phone application. Uh, I had used here call for opening email application. I had used here mail for sending messages. I had used here MSG function for opening any links. I had used here profile uh, function. So let us see what is inside all this particular function so on call on call function i had used here url and scheme tel which invoke to open the uh, third party application mobile phone by uh, this number and uh, once i had defined the scheme then uh, thereafter i can use here the function uh, can launch url which is given by url launcher package and once it uh, and once it can once this condition is true it can launch the url and perform the respective scheme uh, here i had used the scheme tail, uh, tail so it will open mobile phone uh, phone application when uh, i had uh, when i had mentioned the scheme mail to it will open email application when i mention the scheme sms it will open messaging application L uh, like this way uh, like this way you can uh, uh, you can use the scheme and you can open uh, the respective application but for profile section i had used here can launch url and it will launch url in the pro uh, platform default mode by default it will open as a web view uh, in uh, in uh, your application but if you want to open externally then you can go for launch mode dot then if you can use external application or external non browser application and it will open uh, chrome or your uh, default web browser and uh, and there the link will be open so this is how you can use url launcher for opening third party application and for opening any custom url in a web view as well as in a, your default browser so this is all about uh, web view and the url launcher package which explains how to use a, a particular url and open it in a, a in your uh, developed flutter application or any third party application if you want to read the articles then you can uh, go on my medium profile and you can check uh, check it here for the web view you, you have to visit tip number 9 and for the url launcher you have to uh, you have to open tip number 10 and if you want any code i had already uploaded it in my github repository you can check it out here so uh, this is all about tip number 9 and tip number 10 and if you like the video then do please like share and subscribe the channel thank you